Jesus took his own life on a cross for two main reasons. The first reason is to cleanse us and to take away the debt that we were given for sin. He committed zero and he we did we committed sin after sin after sin and he took that away from us by dying on the cross. So take some time, thank him for it, and know that he loves you. If he didn't love you, he wouldn't have died on the cross. Not at all. Him dying on the cross for our sins is a testimony as to how much he loves us. So if you think he doesn't, if you, forgive me, I have stage fright. If you think he does not love you, know that it is a lie. It doesn't matter how many sins you commit. Ask for forgiveness and it will be given to you. Repent and the forgiveness will be given to you. Now, the second reason he died on the cross for our sins is so that we could grow a better relationship with him. With that debt being taken away from us and we're free, we receive his Holy Spirit, we receive his faith, and then through prayer and through preaching the gospel, we can grow a better relationship with him and we can help others to get to know him. One of the main reasons he died on the cross for our sins is so that we can know him. If he didn't want us to know him, he wouldn't have taken his life on that cross. Not at all. So, I ask you, my brother, I ask you, my sister, do as I do. Preach the gospel if you have received the calling. I have received the calling. I have received the Holy Spirit. My question to you is, have you confessed your sins to Jesus? Do you believe that he died on the cross for your sins? And do you believe that that's a testimony as to how much love he has for you and I? Just a question. Do you believe that? Now, to end this video while I was going to make this a separate video, but I'm just going to do this all at one, all in one, I'm going to say what I would call a nightly prayer that you would say at night. So let's pray. Father, I thank you for everyone who is watching this video right now. I thank you for another day here on earth, Lord. Please fill us with your faith in your Holy Spirit to guide, direct, and I ask for your guidance among me and everyone else who is watching this video. And I thank you for dying for me. I thank you for taking your life on a cross for our sins so that we can grow a better relationship with you, Lord. I ask that tomorrow we have a better day than we did today and that each day that we go and move, we can get to know you better and get better at preaching to those who act, who do it. And please just guide us throughout our lives, Lord. And ask you help us to just help one another instead of having hatred for one another. And ask that you just fill us with your Holy Spirit fill us with your faith and I ask you protect us throughout the night and throughout the day tomorrow in Jesus name amen